this is day two of the snockalypse. We had a massive weird winter um, snow day in March for some reason in a undis in an anonymous place. Uh, anyways, so this first look at all these trees. It's like they're covered in fully frozen off of ice. And this. It feels so pretty. It's totally frozen with ice. Alright, here's some more leaf things. Look. It's like... Like weird ice excess melts. Never seen this actually. I don't think it's totally brittle. Also, this ice must be like two inches thick. Because... I walked straight over it and had no problems. God dang, it's the snockalypse. I mean, by the way, it's slang for snow apocalypse. God dang it. So, so cold. Alrighty. Goodbye for now. And then now, another. Okay, just came back from school. And, um, yeah, it's snowing again in the middle of March. Ah, God, I almost ran into that tree dagger. Yeah. Alright, I think this is going to end it for Snockalypse Day 2. Oh, by the way, there was a first day one when this thing first struck and I couldn't record any of it. Because it was so cold that I couldn't do anything besides stay inside my house. Anyways, goodbye for now. So, even though it's incredibly cold out there, for some reason my outdoor cat still wants to go outside. I think because there's a few birds around yeah there he is oh by the way this is todd who's also basket cat from the pranked basket cat video also he just likes to attack snow out of nowhere it's not like there's any animals in it <laughs> what the heck hi todd oh no <laughs> what the heck is it the pieces of grass that's been in? I don't know. Weirdo. Day three of the snockalypse. Nothing much has changed and my cat is outside with me. <laughs> Alright. So I'm about to walk across this snow plane. What? Oh my god. It's even more solid than yesterday. So yeah, this was- this is snow. This isn't ice or, like, ground. This is probably, like, six inches of snow. Oh, you can see my pet footsteps. Or Ethan's. Ethan's my brother, by the way. Yeah. It's really weird. Alright. I'll turn the camera back on when I see something interesting. And here's that ice from before. As you can see, it's totally covered in snow. I can just walk across. Yeah, it's some thick ice. So yeah, once again, another showing of the ice effect. Like, what this thing's. That's just weird. Right, day four of the snockalypse. The snow was melting, but I guess when it shows some, af show some after effects. See, these trees are totally weighed down by all the snow and ice on them. You can actually see the one right there has these like little icicles hanging off it in this awkward direction. And they're, they're, total, they're totally weird looking. And then over here, look at that. Those are all the branches that came down. Right, um, you know, but next to our road. Yeah. Yeah, this the snowstorm really um, hit hard. Though, around my town, there was way worse branches than that. Uh, in fact, a few trees, like, trees that big over there actually fell down because of the ice and stuff. <clears throat> so we were pretty lucky. Also, sorry if I sound weird, it's, um, I have a sore throat. Anyways, 
I think this is like, let me test this one. The snow is somehow harder than yesterday. It's very crunchy. Yeah. Anyways, this may be the final episode. I don't know. Um, there's not really anything to record now. But I basically covered all the stuff that happened. Uh, so goodbye.